Hey, what's up everyone? Sam here. So in this list, I'm going to be showing you five foods that have been genetically modified beyond recognition. Number five, carrots. Carrots have been around for thousands of years. In fact, seeds dating back to 5,000 years have been discovered in Europe. However, originally carrots looked a lot different. They were small and white rather than very long and orange. The carrots we have today are known as Western carrots. However, some other carrots still exist, which are most commonly called Eastern carrots. These carrots can be smaller in size and also even purple rather than orange. Number four, bananas. Bananas are believed to have been first cultivated around seven to 10,000 years ago. The long yellow banana most people know are a result of centuries of careful breeding. They descended from two wild banana species called Musa acuminata and Musa balbiciana. These two banana species don't taste like bananas we have today. In fact, one has lots of hard seeds in the middle. However, thousands of years ago, banana cultivators discovered that cross-pollinating these two plants produced a sweet, yellow, seedless fruit that tasted really good. This is how modern day bananas were born. Number three, watermelons. Experts agree that watermelons originated somewhere in Africa and spread to the Mediterranean. One of the watermelon's earliest ancestors was first cultivated in Egypt around 4,000 years ago. This watermelon was hard, bitter, and pale green in color. However, they did still contain lots of water. It's believed the watermelon was an excellent source of water for people, especially during the dry seasons, and that's the reason why they grew them. It's also believed it was the Egyptians who began to selectively breed the sweetest and best watermelons over many years, which led to the tasty sweet watermelons we have today. Number two, corn. It's believed corn is one of the first crops ever cultivated by humans around 10,000 years ago. However, at that time, corn was a lot different to what we have today. The earliest ancestor of corn that we know of is something called teosint. This plant doesn't look anything like corn today, but they did produce kernels which were a lot smaller. However, on a genetic level, the plants are almost identical. Over thousands of years of artificial selection, corn has changed massively in its appearance. This was done by people selecting only the plants that produce the most kernels. Number one, peaches. Fossils of peaches have been discovered in China that date back over 2.5 million years ago. However, these peaches would have been a lot smaller than today and resemble small cherries. Once again, through artificial selection, the peaches that were the biggest and contained the most flesh were chosen. This led to the peach being much larger with lots of juicy edible flesh. It's believed it only took about 3,000 years for the peach to turn from a small cherry-like fruit to what it is today. Thank you for watching. To subscribe, click over here to watch another awesome videos and click down here. Do make sure to turn on channel notifications and follow me on Instagram, Twitter and Snapchat. All details are on screen and in the description below. Once again, thank you for watching and until next time, feed your mind.